The more you associate happiness with curiosity, the happier you'll be when your curiosity is satisfied. Welcome to the happy channel. It's TRS Clips. What do you think about crystals? Oh, crystals. We love crystals. Okay. Uh, crystals are very powerful. I, I, I used to laugh upon them. In the same way, I laughed mm. upon meditation at one point <laughs> in my life. And now I'm building a meditation app. You know, at the end of the day, every person on this earth is going to experience something they always laughed on, never believed on. And then that is the day they'll become believers. Yeah. Um, Your crystals. Yeah, man. It, yeah, one more thing that just entered my life. Just I didn't ask for it. Was just drawn to a crystal shop, bought some, saw the effects, drawn to another shop, bought so, some. So, uh, I'm not making this up right now, but as we are coming, we were planning to get you something. Then we were like, you know, we were just meeting for the first time. Some people think, oh, he's just, you know, being very stalker or something like that. But I'm like, you know, I'll just meet him for now. And if things continue, I'll get him that thing. I was planning to get you raw crystals <laughs> because we have crystals, raw crystals. And I was planning to get you crystals. This is not a and coincidence. And when you said, I was like, F <laughs> I was planning to get it. <sighs> yeah. I appreciate it, man. Uh, but what do you think of it? They are, uh, see, crystals, again, uh, uh, if we go to the scientific part of it, they come from nature. And nature has all kind of answers to, you know, whatever is happening here. Yeah. And considering they are so seeped into it for millions and millions of years, they have all the abilities of healing, protecting, shield, uh, protecting, shielding and everything if done the right way. So uh, crystals can certainly be used to keep not just negative spirits away, but also negative people away. Uh, crystals can also be used for cleansing a place. Crystals can also be used to heal yourself. But the important part, Ranveer, in everything that we have talked right now is you should know what you're doing. That's important. What does that mean? That means that the, the crystals, for example, they need to be charged. So if you're not charging, you're just keeping it in one corner and attending it two, three years later, it's, it has gone dormant. You have to reactivate it. Those how, are... How do you react? A, a very basic way is uh, moon's energy, sun's energy. The sun, moon, they all are radiating some energies, all frequencies. You know, that's why even during full moon, there are full moon meditations. There are new moon meditations. There are solar eclipse meditations because during all those astronomical phenomena, there's some changes happening in the environment. If we meditate, if we can tap into it in the positive way, we can get a lot of benefits from it. Some way, the crystals can also be activated using those methods. You leave it in moonlight or sunlight. Yes, yes. That's it. That's it. And next day, you're all fine. Also, if you know Reiki healing, you know other healing, you can heal it and cleanse it off. Because ultimately what the crystal is doing is it is absorbing all the bad things and negativity of your life, no? So some, after some time it has reached its limit. So until unless you, uh, you know, dump it and refill it with its normal energy, it's like a remote where you have to keep changing the batteries. Do you think meditating around it charges it? Yes, it does. It does. But again, if you are putting a little bit of intention that you are charging, you know, intention and visualization can go a long way in meditation. Yeah. It's a, it's a very base of meditation, you yeah. know, of course there are various ways of meditation, but the moment you bring in the visualization and that's why when you said the Spider-Man, I connected so much because Dr. Strange mm. or what I was shown in the Dr. Strange is so true in the spiritual world. Yeah. There are layers to the soul and the symbols he uses and everything very connectable, mm. you know, so intention and visualization to important part. Okay. Um, they have their own intelligence crystals. Yes, it, they do. They do. Uh, maybe someday later when I have the crystals, I'll show you uh, uh, that you can do something and you'll see them move. They'll, they'll, they'll start fluctuating because of your energy. And from the, if we go back to the topic we had of Dragon Ball Z, that there's something in our body that if projected the right way, it can change everything around. Life force, chi. Yes, yes. Chi mm. is the right word for that. Prana. Prana, yeah. So they can do affect crystals and also human being. That's how healing originated, no? Yeah. And that's when people elevated to being healers. Yeah. I meditate in this room, dude. And uh, I've seen that the plants here flourish a lot. Of course, they have to be. When I saw this snake plant and that monster up behind, they're so well, very, very well done considering this is a podcast room and you have to keep it very shut yeah. to keep the noise out. And still with minimum oxygen and everything, even though they don't need much, Still, still flourishing right now. Yeah. Um, don't put too much care into them. It's just, I don't know. But I meditate here. I yeah. do Om Chanting. And there's something to do with the Om Chanting. Mm. Uh, I have crystals in my room now. Okay. Again, was never a believer. I feel mm. them helping me for sure, man. Correct. It um, does. 
So does. yeah, just that's all I'll say. <laughs> like the activities you choose to do, the yeah. vibe you put out changes your environment, yes, man. It does. So TRS Clips has all sorts of videos and all sorts of playlists. Make sure you explore the channel by subscribing and heading to our homepage and reading through all the playlists.